Hello and today we're playing Theme Hospital on the PS1. It's personally one of my favourite bulldog, bull, bulldog, bullfrog games. What do you think, Joe? I think it's alright, yeah. Yeah. I used to play this on the PC when I was younger. And um, I prefer it that way, it's less fiddly. You've always played it on console, haven't you? Yeah. This is Joe's th third hospital. Yep. And I've got a choice between two shit nurses. I'll go for nurse dad. Arrogant and cocky versus one that don't give a shit. I need a drink, so I'm going to duck under the camera. Steve's up. I like how that still shows on a PS1 game. So proper. She has a terrible case having a baby inside it. No, oh, Jesus! I'm sorry, I have to tell you, you're the smoker from Left 4 Dead. I need to spell the diagnosis. <laughs> Isn't that basically what your old hospital was? It's going to have to be in this case. I might just build that actually. I'm going to buy a new ward and I'm just going to build all diagnosis rooms. Can't you just expand it into one massive diagnosis room and make it more effective? No, that's not thing. Yeah, one thing I put uh, one thing reason I like the PC version is you can expand the rooms and all that. You can expand the rooms, it's just you can't put more stuff in them. You press the triangle. Damn it. Gonna have this real long thin one and it's all gonna be the diagnosis area. Square! I did it, yeah! <laughs> Your name's Horsley. Yeah. Why not? I don't know, it's just what came with the game. Alright then. So, okay, it's alright. It's not bad then. Not Keith, is it? What is the most, what's the least appealing male name? Keith. <laughs> Derek. Jim. Nah, Jim's a cool name. Yeah, Jim's cool. They might not get used, but I'm building them anyway. You need to remember the receptionist, otherwise people won't know where to go. Aye. They need some doddery old biddy to tell them. It's kind of like it's kind of like Walmart greeters. Yeah, but at least with them you get a bite. Yeah, but if they don't get a greet, you'll just have some old ladies dumping a change on the floor and guy walk into a wall. You reckon that's enough diagnosis? No. You have six already and it's still demanding more. Right, so one's invisible, three are hobos. That one's got fat head. One's playing snake. Yeah, you know, I'll build a backup GP office in there as well. The computer has been enhanced by a research department. You had a research department? There's a new slicer. And that'll be for the tongue people. Aye. Where is it? Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's a fucking paper slicer! It is, yeah. Oh, that always made me giggle. Oh, I couldn't fit it there as well. See if I could fit it there. When you can't just try to head the door open. Oh, tough. Right, so I'm just under halfway, I think. No, I said halfway about five minutes ago. Yeah, but I've spent money since. Ah, uh, alright. Oh, yeah, you need to reach 100 grand, don't you? Yeah. Well, he would have been playing for about three years. I uh, What's his deal? He's invisible.
You can fuck off if you think I'm buying building more diagnosis rooms. GPs, fair enough. Take a chance of possible cure. I will. Let's see, where is he going? He's gone that way. He should be going to here. Well, that one need. Well, she needs a shit. What? That sounds really. Well, she was cured. Hey, what's his deal as well? Then? And this, like, diagnosis means more GPs, because they're the ones that actually diagnose the illness. Mm. You know what, I'll build up some backup GP offices. Alright. Don't forget the receptionist room in there, otherwise no bill now. No, no, no. Top one. Right in front of the fucking door. Yeah, she's just being a fucking nuisance. Right. Well, I'll hire some doctors to get into them as well. No, no. Okay, maybe not. So you got three killers and a potential Killer. Yeah. Yeah, you really should not be hiring from the prison system. Right then, just to the inmates. Right then, watch your skills. I killed three babies. You ready? That's you. Right, what's your crown then? Murder. The order of stalker, that's the difference. Oh, actually, you're the baby killer. Yeah, of old London town. When you, you know, when you add old London town, it makes it less scary. I know. I'm the baby manager of old London town. I'm the phantom raspberry boy of old London town. That was in the beano. That one. It's from the two Ronnies. And there was a beano sketch. Ooh, it's thick. He's ignoring it. Who's ignoring what? He must be cleaning up the sick. I think he's still busy watering plants. To be fair. No, I wanted there to fall on it. Oh my God! Everyone's ignoring the sick. <laughs> yeah, sweep up the sick. That's how you do it. I'll take a chance on the possible cure if he dies, I don't care. General practitioner, everybody! I like how the mascot of this game looks like the dippiest bloke ever. It looks like Smithy. It's you with glasses. Right then, last minute. There's not really much more to say about this game apart from it's one of, one of Bullfrog's best work. And um, there should have been more to him, shouldn't they? Mm. Well, more of them. He died. Oh, you just killed your first patient. Yay. I told you, give him the medicine, not hit him with golf club. I'm making whole royal. <laughs> what, with the Tories in charge? Yeah. Well, no, just whole royal as it is now. Yeah. Well, to be fair, there ain't enough people laying on bloody carts in corridors for it to be all royal, but it's oh, worth the time. Oh, yeah. Just, my, nana's got, my nana's got nails in her head. I'll send her home. I can't be asked. Yeah. Right, plus, there's not that eight-hour waiting time to know what's called. No. Well, there's several days, dude. You're beating all yeah, royal. Yeah, I mean, these are the cracking shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He must be all that shit for three days. <laughs> yeah. He must have just had a baby. Anyway, thank you for watching. And see you in my next video.